No, it's not Star Wars or Independence Day, but it certainly is a step to the Warcrafts of the future. The U.S. Navy's laser weapon system, the first of its kind, launched on the naval ship the USS Ponce early in November. The new weapon can neutralize targets with nothing more than concentrated energy. All it is is directed energy. So it's no different than if you're out in the sun for four or five hours and you get a sunburn. Think about that amount of energy being concentrated into a microsecond. So that amount of energy being placed on a target in a very small amount of time is going to cause a chemical and physical disruption in the structural integrity of that target. Though not as powerful as other weapons aboard a typical military ship, Harmer says the laser will have useful applications in fending off attackers. So if there's a number of small targets attacking a Navy vessel, the gun is simply going to run out of ammunition before it engages all the targets. Whereas with a laser, you can more or less continuously fire a laser as long as you've got adequate power supply and adequate cooling supply. Although you can't see it, the laser neutralizes a target by sending a beam of energy, cooking everything in its path. Now operational, the prototype laser costs just 59 cents a shot. That is a fraction of the cost of launching a weapon such as the Navy Standard Missile II, which has a sticker price of $400,000 each. Although the U.S. Navy is far from developing the laser cannons of the Starship Enterprise, it has taken a first step to the future of military technology.